What's going on there, fellow YouTubers? It's Chris back with you guys with another cool video. I've been away for a while, but that's okay. I've got this one here to do, and I'm not going to make it very long. Um, but because it's, it's something I'm going to break up in pieces for you guys to check this thing out. But I believe these are not just craters that we're finding on Pluto. I believe that they're either domes that have been crashed or uh, smashed to pieces, or it's just the way they're designed. And you're going to find out what I mean because it's it's bizarre. I mean... There's especially one telltale, telltale sign that these are, in fact, something of intelligent, uh, intelligently made, if you will, and not ge geological process like they want you to believe, like ice, you know, formations and stuff like that. Let me show you the page I'm talking about. Okay, so this is the one from NASA, and you can see it up here in the upper left. Um, new findings from NASA's New Horizons shape understanding of Pluto and its moons. And I'm not going to read the whole page to you because I'm going to give it to you anyway. But on the right-hand side is the, is the photo um, it's in question. Uh, really good photo, by the way. Um, and you can see it's, it's pretty long, So, but, you know, all the way down. Look at this. This thing's long. It's a big, uh, big photo. Zigzagging across Pluto, this high-resolution swath of Pluto right sweeps over the cratered plains at the western New Horizons uh, and counter hemisphere across numerous prominent faults, skimming the eastern margin of dark, of the dark rather, forbidding region un, uh, informally known as, and I'm not even sure how to pronounce this, uh, Thulhu Re Regio, or Regio, depending on how you want to pronounce it, and finally passing over the mysterious, uh, possibly cryovolcanic edifice right Mons, as they call it, before reaching the terminator of day and night line, which you will see way up here. And, of course, it goes way down to here, and it starts getting into the dark. You can see where it starts to fade off. So I want to show you this, because this is really, really bizarre, guys. This is cool. Now, I'm going to just show you here. I'm going to back out. And you see I already started to make this. Uh, this is the way it comes, just like this. Um, and I'm going to make sure we're in CMYK, which is full color, even though this is black and white. So, But what I want you guys to look at, and I'm going to show you this, is that right now it doesn't look like too much. But for some reason... Every one of these uh, craters have, like, something on the right-hand side, like over here. I'm going to do this here. Um, we can just do that. Uh, all on the right-hand side, you're going to find these objects in them. Or at least what looks like uh, like a quarter of a, t um, uh, of a dome type thing. Is it a shield? Is it? I don't know. Uh, I'm going to leave that up to you guys, and you guys can tell me what you think it is. So... As I'm doing this, I said, let's immediately go to black plate so we can have a look at this. So when I did this, I said, all right, well, let's go into view, go into the black plate. Now, this is going to get brighter, of course. Now, we're going to just go ahead and start bringing this down. Now, I'm going to go over to here. And this is just bizarre, guys. Everything about this. I mean, this is, and you've seen this just marked off. I'm going to go ahead and go down to uh, CMYK. But you'll see this a lot better in a moment because this is just cool. I mean. This right here, it has this weird. And it has what all of this stuff in the background, it's all around the right side of it. Again, this one right here. Now, you might say, well, you know, that's nothing, you know, seriously, blah, 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 blah. But watch this. As I'm going to go down, I'm just going to take my time with it. As you go down, I'm just going to show you the, and mock them off. It, it looks like this stuff, like, like debris, like it's not just a crater per se. Look at this right here like it looks like it's overhung over this thing now i'm not saying that's exactly a straight piece i'm, I'm just saying that I'm just squaring off this right here and as we go down this and i'm going to show you in a lot better uh more instead of being so what's the word i'm looking for um you know grainy we're going to clear it up a bit for you guys and i'm going to just show you this is just bizarre um in fact i'm going to do this now watch this go into this and we'll go into we'll go into the black plate. Now I'm just gonna back up just a hair on this, and we'll just go like this. And as we're going down, I'm gonna show you this because this is just bizarre. Now these, it makes sense. Like this one here, I would say this is. I'm just gonna do a white outline. That kind of looks like a crater to me. Makes sense, no doubt. This is what you expect to see of a crater. Meaning you'll see what looks like whatever impacted this surface. Um you would say, okay, well, that makes perfect sense because it, in fact, looks like that. It looks like something hit, and then there's your crater wall right there. So that makes sense to me. Check this out. Right here, again, overhanging, and it's always on the right-hand side. Now, this one's not, of course. Check this out. 
it seems like there's always something on the right hand side, but it gets better and better. You're gonna say, ah. some of the skeptics are gonna say, what is this guy talking about? Watch, it gets better and better. Again, this is not really a weird. It just doesn't make sense. This is where it kind of gets starts getting bizarre. Look at this. This one here. Okay, check this one out. Look at the way this thing is. It has this cr supposed crater, but it has this area here that's overhanging this and it has a shadow again here this little one has this weird shape inside and goes like this every one of these check this out this one here it seems to be on the right hand side now is it possible it's the light but the light is supposedly coming from and i'm trying to remember where this is coming from because they just it really doesn't show too well um because it's it's darker this is the brightest pot which is supposed to be up here at the top and there really is no way to see which way the sun is coming. Now, and check this out. This gets better and better and better. Look at this. Another one. Has this weird hood. And it's kind of oval. It's not round. Look at this one here. Same thing. Now, of course, I'm doing this in light, so meaning a light colored. Uh, this one, same way. This one, same way. Check this one out. What? This thing is bizarre. And look at this. It has like inner pots to this thing. And what looks like it has this weird design to it. And this piece is coming out. I mean, this is just bizarre, guys. Now, check this out. Look at these craters here. I'm going to go ahead and, well, I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. But let's see what happens here. I'm going to go back here real quick. And you can see what looks like this objects all inside these supposed craters this and let's just say it's natural there but when you see this i want to let you guys check these out and it's just it's cool uh, again look at the inside of this crater on this wall here check this one out now i'm going to go back to where we were at here uh, we'll just go down here in fact i might just leave it like this for a minute again here has this weird outline feature this one, same thing. Something sitting right there. <laughs> what the hell is this, guys? And it just gets better. Watch this. This one here. This one here. I'm going to get down to these bottom ones because this gets bizarre more and more. You look at this stuff. Look at this. Look what's in the middle of this. Looks like some kind of round piece spidering off. And there's something right in the middle. Let me do this. And I'm going to bring this up like this. Check that out. What the hell? Now, check this one out. Same thing. It has this weird little hood type thing facing the right hand side of this thing. Check this one out. Look at the size of this thing. And it looks like it has this weird overhang. Now, let's keep going. Check this thing out. What is that? It looks like, well, you know, you see on like the, the ancient folklore in Asia, it looks like there's dragon type thing. But check the way this thing does this. Goes, goes all like this. Well, I kind of messed that up. But when it gets down to this part here, it goes like this. Boom, boom. Kind of like a triangle with a dot. And goes like this. And then look at the actual features inside. And I've got, I think it's, I've got it lighter. Right there. Check that out. Again, here's another little one. What looks like a half a hood. Or like a half a wall or a dome, if you will. Another one. Right here. The crazy thing about it is, if I'm not mistaken, which I could be. I'm not sure if this is the one. It may not be. Let's keep going down here. Look at this. It looks like the things that like fell apart or something. It doesn't look like your typical crater. And I don't know what a typical crater might look like. But if you look at the moon, some of the ones we have on our own planet, uh, there's a bunch of ejecta. And it doesn't have what looks like things going across the, th uh, the actual thing. This is where it gets better and better. Watch this. Here. Check out what's inside this. Let me see if I can go back to this. Check this out. I'm going to go back. I'm going to go ahead and go to... CMYK, check this out. It looks like little pieces are in here actually going along the wall. Okay, this one here. Half of, it looks like half of this crater, which is really bizarre because it's oval and not round. This in here. Now, it, it will keep going. <laughs> this is cool. Another one here. Everything seems to be on this right-hand side of these craters. Now, 
check this out. This is where it will blow your mind. This here, look, it's, it's like it's going over the whole center of this crater. Check that out. What does that, guys? This is where it gets super cool. Here, two conjoining, and, and look, it's in the middle of it. Now, let's go to this here, and I'm going to bring this back up into black plating so we can brighten this up a bit. Okay, right there, check that out. I'm just going to do this. Now, this is where it puzzles your mind. There's no doubt in my mind. Check this out. What the hell is this? This. And look at this. What puts three perfect circles in a row inside a giant circle? What the hell does that? Now, I'm going to go back here for a second because even in the normal photo, you can see that one, two, there's a couple more, but there's three. And then you can see the way the, of course, it's really grainy. So we don't want that. So we bring it back down. And there you go. And look at all this stuff in this whole area. It makes you wonder, guys, what the hell could possibly do that naturally? I'm sorry. I don't believe that. Um, here you go. Check this out. And all I did was just took the dodge tool, went like this, goes over the whole area, and this brought these out even brighter. Check that out. Seriously? Where's the other ones here? Um, I think this is where it stopped, pretty much. But every one of these has something inside these so-called craters. This, to me, just goes, whoa, hold on a minute, man. Hold on. I don't know of anything that can do that naturally. Perfectly round circle. This right here, I don't know what that is inside. With these three dots as well in this giant area here. Don't know how big it is. Couldn't tell you. But I'm going to let you guys have this so you can actually take your eyepieces. In fact, you can look at it now. Or your, your simple uh, mags, magnifying glasses. Check this stuff out, guys. Um, I mean, look at this thing. This is just bizarre as hell. I mean, boom, boom. There was one that actually has a shadow. Let me see if I can find that for you. Um, I don't think it was this one. There's one that actually casts a shadow. This actual wall or whatever this thing is has a shadow to it. Now, what could do that is beyond me. Um, as far as it looks, like I said, like a quarter dome, like it's trying to protect itself from maybe the sun, which I don't know why it would, because you would think it would need it, being it's that far away from the sun. Um, I'm trying to remember if it was, it was something similar to this one here, where I had this piece up here. Now, I want to see if this is it. But this one here is bizarre. I mean, look at that. This one. This one. They all seem to have this weird little canopy, if you will, or a quarter of a, um, you know, I'm going to use dome. I mean, for lack of better words, I don't know. Again, here, here. Look at every one of these. Since when do craters do that? And they all seem to do it. No matter what size they are, they all do it. Here it is right here. This is the one I showed you earlier. Check this thing out closely. And I'm going to pause for a second. You guys can look this over. Pause the video if you like. And check this out. Look at the way this thing goes. And I'm going to try to get this back in color again. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to just outline this thing real quick. Check this out. I'm going to go like this. Well, that ain't it. Let's go ahead and do this. Check this out. Goes like this. Goes over. Goes up. And then goes over. Well, guess what? So doesn't the shadow. Check this out. Right here. And then goes like this. Check it out. That means this pot here is higher than this pot right here. So this is coming up. It drops down. And then comes back up. And, and the shadow reflects that. It actually shows this. See it here? Goes up. Well, there's the shadow. It's up and it goes back down. Or it's just another pot that actually looks kind of like what's missing on this side. I don't know. You guys tell me. I want to let you check this out yourselves. And my God, this is just bizarre. Um, so give me your thoughts on this, guys. This is just a quick one, but I got some moon stuff coming up for you too. Um, is it possible when you look at this photo here, and like I said, I mean, just, I mean, look at these things. What the hell? Almost every one of these has this weird, bizarre hood, part of a uh, protective shield, part of a dome. Every one of these. And they're all in the right-hand side. What do you guys think they can be? Naturally formated um, formations? Is it, look at, little one here, got the same thing. And I'm going to let you guys check this out because this is at, I think, 200%. Uh, so let's do this, put it, bring it down to 100%. And I want to let you guys have this at 100%. And I'll break it down into sections. And you guys could check this out with your mag glasses because this is bizarre. But it's cool at the same time. I like this. 
Um, I mean, look at these. When you look at this right here, there's all kinds of what looks like stuff all over this, this top of this so-called crater, all in here. See that? All in the top, but it's always on the right-hand side. What the hell could be doing that? There's something that looks like it kind of goes over this one. Look at this. It kind of looks like it overhangs this whole thing. I, I don't know, guys. You, you tell me. I just find it very bizarre that these things happen to be inside. Look at this. It looks like it's almost like it's hollow, like this thing can go straight into it, whatever it is. I'm not saying all of them are. I'm sure they are. A lot of these are, in fact, uh, craters. But check this out. Why does it look like these things overhang these so-called holes, all these craters? Look at this. And then you get this half of this crater. I don't know. You guys tell me. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. I think this is pretty bizarre. Um, and I really like this. This is the thing I found most in this photo. This is what I wanted to share with you guys. You guys tell me what you think this is. I'm going to go back over to the black plating. And I'm going to go back into, well, this is black plate. And we'll, go, we'll just check this out again. I mean, it's just, oh, man. And the more you look at this thing, you just go, there's, there's no way these are natural. So check this out yourself, guys. Give me your thoughts. But this right here, this is the one that blew my mind. Like I said, you can check these all out. But I mean, all the, look at that. Look at this. One, two, a smaller one. They're all in the same direction. What does that? Looks like a river of some sort. Check that out. Again, on the right-hand side. And then look at this one right here. What looks like it has a city or some kind of structure in the middle of it. Again, a small one right here. What the hell? Another here. And they all seem to be facing the same way. What could do that? This one looks like it's been demolished and it has this overhanging piece. This here. And I'm going to give you the different filters, guys, so you guys can check this out. But when you go down to here, this one's bizarre. This is just neat. This whole area, to me, just screams intelligently made. But I want to leave that up to you guys, and I got some more. I, I, this, guys, I, if you're into the moon, I've got so much moon videos. I can do them for a month from from here on. There's just so much to see, and I'm gonna I'm gonna try to either put a collage together with different things, or I'm gonna just be doing some more moon videos and awesome stuff to see on these. Awesome, awesome stuff. So guys, stay tuned for that. Let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment down below. Share the video. Um, and like I said, stay tuned because I'm going to be doing these. going to be knocking these out uh, one at a time and getting them out a lot sooner. So stay tuned for that. But again, thanks for uh, you know watching. Uh, like I said, share the video. Throw me a thumbs up. Always appreciate it. You guys know that. And we will see you in the next video.